Hello guys, welcome once again to World War II season number 9 I am playing with, where are my, my paper for my friends uh, No Limit and Sergeant Schulze as the Axis No Limit playing as Japan, Schulze as Germany and Corporal Clegg as the UK, me Piloto playing as the USSR and the USA also I'm um, receiving some um, like help from Corporal Clegg for playing as the USA so it's like uh, USA is controlled by the two of us, only I am doing the videos. So yeah, um, <laughs> I was on video for uh, from No Limit from Japan, it's a shame you guys couldn't see it, but I don't know, I, I just um, love when he used that movie. Now I know the name, I just forget about it, but I got the video, so yeah. Uh, he made some um, good attacks, man. I I, <laughs> I was thinking maybe just attack this place, but I think it's, it will be a, a, just a suicide. So yeah, what I'm going to buy as the USA, uh, I'm going to buy um, one carrier, two destroyers, one transport, one artillery, and I am spending 41 IPCs, saving one for the bank. And yeah, sorry about that. Okay, so let's continue with the combat movements. We have here um, zero combat movements in the Pacific, but we have one here in in command here in the Atlantic. We are moving two transports from Sea Zone 11 with two infantry, one artillery, and one tank. They are moving into Sea Zone 13 into Morocco. So I'm not going to um, get anything of this in the battle board. So just remember. Two infantry with one artillery and one tank against one German infantry. So yeah, uh, let's do it. I'm going to use uh, three red dice for the infantry at two, and one black dice for um, the tank. Let me get the camera in a better position. Okay, so yeah, one of the infantry is attacking at one. Sorry. So I'm going to use one white dice for that one. <laughs> and we have a hit from the infantry at one. So I'm using a uh, color coded like these ones. Um, so you know which is one. So now let's use a red dice for the German infantry at Morocco. And we have a miss. So uh, Morocco is captured. And that should be, uh, it was a, a easy fight. Okay. So that should be a one IPC plus for USA and one less for Germany. So Germany should be at 38, 38. 38 and the USA at 41. So not that big of a loss. Now, uh, the interesting part, the non-combat movements. Let's start here in the Pacific. So as usual, um, <clears throat> we are moving everything. Um, yeah, let's start here. I'm moving the carrier in season 50, 55 with one destroyer and one sub into season 44. Also the fighter in the Hawaiian Islands is moving one, two and three and landing on that carrier battleship and destroyer in season 56 moving into season 44 and the carrier in season 56 picking up these two infantry from uh, western united states and carrying them on on that uh, united states transport also here um i am moving the fighter in western united states into season 56 for the incoming carrier <clears throat> And here uh, the cruiser in season 19 is going to move into the Pacific. Also this guy from Central is moving into uh, Western United States. The bomber into Western United States and the carrier into that season. Let's, let's just move everything. Okay, so yeah, the carrier is going to land here. The bomber in Western United States and the cruiser was moving here in 50, 55? Ah, this is 53, sorry guys. <laughs> the Hawaiian Islands is the 53 and the cruiser is moving into season 56. Also the destroyer here 
in 11 is moving 1 and 2 into season 19 and yeah now that's it now let's uh proceed with uh getting the units the carrier in season 56 oh uh, come on we need it to look nicely okay so the transport there two destroyers and one artillery in western united states we are uh getting 41 ipcs we were saving uh, another for the last turn so we are getting 42 ipcs again for the next turn as a usa and now let's do the uh, ussr turn okay so ussr it's uh buying five infantry and three artillery for 27 ipcs uh, we are saving one in the bank and uh, now let's proceed with the combat movements okay uh, we have uh, one combat movement here we are moving one infantry and one artillery from Caucasus and all the three fighters in Moscow Moscow so uh, these guys are getting one and two so they are remaining with two movements in their gas cage let me just see if i could get okay that's a little better i think and now i am doing a in and out attack from western russia yeah west russia into Belarus russia and go going back so that's uh, a take for the ussr and we are i am moving the guy from leningrad into the baltic states so those are another two ipcs i'm going to move them right now because i'm going to forget it i'm going to forget about it if i just let the time pass so those are four ipcs for the ussr from 26 to 30 and uh yeah it's germany <laughs> from 38 to 34 and um, yeah those are the combats now let's proceed and do this one in um in romania or ukraine i think so yeah let's let's do it we have uh from the ussr one infantry and one artillery and we have um three fighters and from germany we have two infantry so another two red dices okay let's first with the ussr and we have two hits awesome okay now let's go with um the german turn returning fire come on miss miss and <laughs> both misses i'm so sorry guys i feel like i am playing with warpig all again I'm so sorry guys okay so at least just kill me kill kill one of my infantry okay so um ukraine is taken and those are two more ipcs for um the ussr ah, come on so ah, come on come on so those are uh ussr is going to 32 and germany is going to 32 as well so now let's proceed with the non-combat movements oh i forget about one non-combat movement as the usa i'm going i was going to move everything in Kang, obviously so we could ult a little longer against japan i'm going to do it just right now i'm so sorry guys um yeah this was for the non-combat as the usa and as the ussr i was moving this guy from sketch one and these other two guys from novosibirsk yeah and now here i am uh, moving one infantry from russia into west russia infantry and artillery from caucasus into west russia and one a gun from russia into west russia and then also i'm moving my three fighters into west russia come on focus that's it so i have everything in west russia and now i'm placing my units so two infantry are going into leningrad 
one infantry and artillery in, are going into Russia and two infantry and two artillery are going into the Caucasus yeah that's it so uh, as the USSR I am collecting I am collecting 32 31 32 uh, but I was saving one in the bank so I am just going to uh, add it right now so I'm at 33 and now let's proceed with the recap of the turn so let's start with the USA oh sorry uh, here in Morocco we have two infantry one artillery one tank with two transports in season um, I need new glasses guys 13 uh, one destroyer in season 19 here in China uh, the name is evacuation so sketchy one only have one UK fighter but Xinjiang have two USA fighters the flying tigers and three USSR um, infantry here in the Pacific is where we want to take the things a little more fun because there is nowhere there is never battles in the Pacific so let's see if we could get some uh, here in 44 we have two destroyers one submarine one battleship one carrier with two fighters and one transport with two uh, infantry units here in um, in this season it's 56 we have two destroyers one transport one cruiser and one carrier with two fighters and in western united states i we have uh, one infantry one artillery one uh, a strategic bomber a gun and one uh, infantry in Alaska so now let's do the uh, USSR uh, recap one infantry in the Baltic states uh, there is nothing in Belarusia in Ukraine USSR SSR we have one infantry and one artillery in the Caucasus two infantry two artillery in Russia, one infantry and one artillery. In Leningrad, two infantry. And in West Russia, let me chip that out. Okay, we have um, eight infantry, three artillery. Yeah, three artillery, one A gun, three fighters, and two tanks. Yeah, so um, that's it. Uh, next player to go is uh, Sergeant Schulze with Germany. Um, it should be an interesting turn. So that, that's all. Thank you for watching and thank you for playing with me, guys. Until next time.